Hello, this is Pastor Ken Carlson. After Jesus was raised from the dead, he appeared more than once to his disciples. On one occasion, it was after the disciples had spent all night fishing. John writes that at dawn, Jesus was standing on the beach, but the disciples couldn't see who he was. He called out, Fellows, have you caught any fish? No, they replied. Then he said, Throw out your net on the right-hand side of the boat, and you'll get some. So they did, and they couldn't haul the net because there were so many fish in it. Jesus told them to go ahead and haul the fish to shore, which was a project, only to find when they got there that Jesus had already prepared breakfast for them. Fresh baked bread and fish broiling on a charcoal fire. And the fact that it was a charcoal fire meant that Jesus had spent some time preparing a meal for them for when they eventually got to shore. This event indicates that Jesus didn't need their help catching fish, but he wanted to include them, not just catching fish, but in ministry that he had in store for them later on. But it was more than that. I've spent the past couple days with a longtime friend that I haven't seen for several years. He invited me to his part of the country because he has some wonderful trout streams here. He wanted to share fishing with me. Yesterday was a beautiful day, but we spent most of the day drowning worms and snagging fishing lines on the Virginia creeper that hangs over the stream. It wasn't until our last hour or so of fishing that we caught anything at all. While catching some trout for supper was fun, what meant so much more was being together. Jesus didn't want his disciples just for what work he could get out of them. He wanted to share a meal with them. It wasn't about the fish. Thank you, Lord Jesus, that you choose us, not for the work you can get out of us, but simply because you love us and enjoy us as your friends. Amen.